The band car is what the orchestra sits on, and we call it a car because it actually does drive in from a garage underneath the stage onto the orchestra pit, and then rises on the orchestra pit, and then the orchestra pit goes down again, and it can go back into the garage so that we can use the orchestra pit during the show. And you can see the orchestra band car is what we call parked in the garage and eventually it's going to come this direction. The band car can go onto the orchestra pit and then can continue on and go onto the first elevator and go further onto the stage and come up in front of the audience in a different position in the stage and we do that all underneath the stage. In the back of the band car there is an area where he lays down and literally drives it forward and backward and he has a, a point on the stage where he stops it because when you move the band car from the garage onto the orchestra pit it has to fit exactly because when the when the pit rises you have to have it fit exactly or it's not going to go up so easily something's going to crash. Oh there is definitely a live orchestra down there. The difference between a recording and having live instruments being played uh, in my, my eyes is dramatic. Many departments uh, combine into just the use of the band car alone. There are carpenters and the carpenters have to make sure that they have steps put in place and removed for uh, the orchestra members so they can get off the band car easily and safely. There are prop men and the prop men make sure that the, the music stands are in place and everything in the band car has been cleaned. And finally the sound department because you can't hear anything without the sound department.